hey what's up everyone welcome again to another tutorial so on this video i'm going to show you how you can run django to cpanel it's very easy so without further words let's get started so first of all you have to log into your cpanel and i'm already logged in on my cpanel so we are going to run django on this subdomain it's called staging.cipher.co.tz so if you are on cpanel please go to software section look for python app so here on software set up python app so click here good then come here to create then you have to choose the version of python you have to use so we are, uh, i'm going to use 3.9 so application root is like your main folder where you are going to run your Django application. So here you may call on all the name you want. So for me, I'm going to just to put Cypher. Uh, let's say, of course not. Let me call it staging. Okay, so my application root is going to be called staging then application url this is the website you have to put your website so make sure your domain is registered but for me instead of putting to cipher.co.tz i'm going to use this subdomain here is called staging.cipher.co.tz of course now here you can leave blank this no need to fill them and then come here and create so remember i'm going to run django 4 so this procedure may be applicable to django 3 but not pretty sure but obviously going to be applied for django 4 and then after creating you can see here on top we have this link here this link is the link which you can be used to activate our virtual environment so just click here to copy it so it has been copied to a clipboard. Now, let's go back to a cPanel and search for terminal. Okay, terminal is here. Now, let's paste this link here. If you paste it here and press enter. So we have already activated our virtual environment. So the next thing we have to do is to install Django. So we're going to use pip. Then install. Uh, install Django. Okay. So it's going to install Django 4.04. .04. Okay, good. Now Django is installed. Let us create our new project. Let's say Django admin. Django dash admin. Start. Start project. Okay, and let's give this project a name of Cypher and let's put space and then dot so means that the folder should be created within this directory so if we click enter here our project has been created now so we may go to our file manager here as we can see that we have a folder named staging here and we can find our new project is here so we may first of all we need to open this and then go to settings.py first of all we need to allow which domains are going to use our our service so here under allowed host Let's just put here a string is ww dot staging dot cipher dot co dot 
tz okay then here we may put also staging staging dot cipher dot co dot tz okay now good let's go ahead and save this then let us close now let's go back to one level and then here we have this folder named passenger underscore wsdi.py we have to edit this okay now add this to just delete all this then just delete from so remember our project name it is cipher um, so cipher dot wsgi then we need to import application okay good now save this and let us close it now let's go back to our python app you need to restart here now good it is restarted now if we come back to our staging.cipher.co.tz let us refresh it here and good django is run on cpanel so guys this is simple way how you can run django to your cpanel so stick to me on the next videos i'm going to show you how we can set our ci cid pipelines using github i'm going to show you how we can set the Django bucket so don't forget to subscribe and liking this video also share to your friends so see you on another video bye bye